Welcome to this tutorial. We'll explain how to create atmospheric environmental lighting for exterior scenes in this video. Before we get started, make sure to subscribe to our channel. Before setting the environment, please turn off the auto exposure. Geo and Sky can reproduce the local sunlight around the world. After setting the location and date, you can adjust the sunlight angle by the time and north offset option. Please note that the sun should cast shadows on the building, achieving a contrast between light and shade. If you want a soft shadow edge, increase the sun disk radius. You can also turn on cloud for a richer background. An appropriate HDRI is critical to creating different environmental lighting for a cloudy twilight, night, or other sky. You can use the built-in HDRI or import your own. For this scene, we want the sunset to spill over the building. So choose a dim HDRI such as early morning and turn down the skylight and background brightness. If you feel the scene looks dim, you can switch on the sun option to reinforce the sunlight and cast shadows. Now, the sun direction follows the HDRI. So you can rotate the HDRI to a proper angle, casting the sunlight from the building side. This way, the contrast between light and shade can make the building look more solid. Yet the sun is lower than the position needed to light up the foreground. So you need to take the second method, custom sun. Increase the sun's altitude and the scene becomes more aesthetic Different angles of the sun can fill the scene with different atmospheres. You can create a night environment with HDRI as well. Choose a dark HDRI and import it into D5. Turn up the skylight or the scene will be too gloomy. Rotate the HDRI as you need. You don't have to switch on the sun at night. That's it. The night environment is all set. After finishing the environmental lighting, you can move on to effects such as exposure. That's all for this tutorial. Thanks for watching.